Hey guys, uh, welcome to another video. This is something that says GBS, but it's not a GBS and I'll explain to you why this is a scam or not worth it. And uh, yes, I got it, so you don't need to buy it. And if you're looking for a GPS, look somewhere else and not this unit here. It came on this bag, believe it or not, and I can see you being very shocked because you know, from Alibaba, the quality is the highest and here's your uh, instructions that we are gonna read for sure here's the premium plastic bag i'll put it there here is a premium usb uh micro usb which i'm not sure if i can trust it as much as i can throw it and let's put that on the side and now time for the beauty of the show it's this unit right here. So in here it says GPS, GF07, and you see all that good stuff. Yes, I tried to use it. That's why you see the scratch marks on it. I tried, I tried, I gave it a shot. Here's where the SIM card goes. Down under there somewhere goes the uh, memory card or micro SD card. Here's the uh, USB charger or charging port here. And data port supposed to be, and why this is not a GPS. Well, let's try to crack it open. I did not open it yet, but based on what I did with it is that it would not, it would not track anything past a mile, mile and a half maximum when you're by the tower. You pass that tower over a mile and a half, you no longer seen on the GPS tracking. And sometimes it would just go off by itself, it would turn on, or when you're very close to it, yes, then it would start tracking. But is that a GPS? No, that doesn't sound like a GPS. That's just a simple ping. A ping is something that gives a signal every few seconds with the SIM card inside to another phone that you have an app or whatever you're tracking with. So this one, to me, seems to be just a ping. I would be very shocked if I saw a GPS module inside. And yes, there's a magnet here, as you see, very weak, very weak. So let's try to crack it open and see what's inside. Yes, that would be the beauty of it. Here we go, it's open. And here are the magnets, the weakest probably you can find. Here's the battery, which is a very discreet battery, by the way. You cannot see what kind of battery I was, I would assume, it, assume it's around 200, 300 milliamp, just based on the size of it. And somehow they managed to put a microphone right here. As you see, that's a microphone. And here is the uh, SIM card tray, and here's the micro SD card tray, here's the antenna supposed connector that hits this part here, if you can call that an antenna. As you see right there, that piece of metal, that's the antenna for it. And on the side, I see a MediaTek chip, I see another RDA chip, but I don't see a GPS module anywhere here. And if you know what I'm talking about, how a GPS module looks like, you would know why I'm saying that. And here's the other side. There's zero GPS modules inside this uh, device. So this is why this is just a pinging device. It only does ping when it's close to the tower and close to the receiver, which means if I have my phone not too far from it, it will have a reading because it's not far from it. And when this, when this device is not too far from the tower itself, it will ping again. So it will grab the signal from the tower and ping it to my phone because it operates, I think maximum 3G, which most of the SIM cards that I have, I had an old one that I had to suffer with the uh, guys there on the phone to, to even activate it, just to see if it works and still didn't work good. Made the SIM card active and made all that effort only to realize that, yeah, wasted six, seven bucks. There are some places I think it's even cheaper if you buy a few of them. I had no interest. I didn't really even have a use for it. But based on what I saw in reviews, reviews looked stellar. We're talking about five-star reviews. And I don't understand how that works. Even on the Amazon, they had stellar level reviews. And that to me didn't sit right. It just didn't make sense. It just, I've seen GPS before. I've seen GPS modules and receivers and transmitters and all that. This is not it. This is a pinger. It only pings, uses that SIM card 
to put the signal fr that comes from the tower and bounce it back to the software that you're connected to and that's all it does it does not do any gps tracking yes it has some kind of voice recorder because we see here there is a microphone a tiny one but it does the job and that's it that's all of it you can buy it and test it for yourself if you don't believe what i'm saying and i'm fine with that and no i have no affiliation with this company or another company so i don't really care i'm just telling you the truth about this device and with that said I hope you learned something and we'll see you next time. Bye!